Joined by Kyle Boudris and Chris Feller after the Beacon 17 to 5 win over nationally ranked Salve Regina. Uh, Kyle, four hits, three runs, three RBI on the day. What was working for you against the very talented Seahawks staff? No, I was just going up there confident, seeing the ball, and uh, just just hit the ball well today. Felt good. You've been hitting extremely well all season long, but how much does it help to be sandwiched between Dan and Chris, knowing that you're going to get to see good pitches? Oh, it's a huge thing. And you're in between them. It doesn't matter if you get out because you know you got a big bat behind you, so you'll be good. And on the flip side of that, with Fernando going today, or Joey going tomorrow, or whoever's going, and you're getting such good pitching, how much easier does that make it on you as hitters knowing you don't have to score 17 runs every game to win? Oh, it's a huge thing. You know, just, just always got to do your thing and uh, um, just roll beaks. Turn it over to Chris. Uh, three more hits on the day, four RBI, and three runs of your own. Um, 28 games in a row now. How much do you think about that, if at all? And what have you been doing this year, maybe that you weren't able to do a year ago? Um. Well, that's just a cherry on top of the cake. It's all about get just getting the win first, and then if I get a hit, that's awesome too. Just keep it going. But then I pretty much changed my whole approach. I'm not chasing pitches this year out of the zone. It makes a huge difference if you're not swinging out of the zone. Usually you're swinging at good pitches. You guys pick up another win here at Monin. I think it's 12 and 3, 13 and 3 at this point. For you as lefties, what makes this uh, part so appealing? Um, I would say just. The gaps are usually pretty big, so I'm just trying to work middle of the field. I'm probably not going to hit one out the right field, almost 400 feet. So I just try to stick to the middle of the field and keep it going. Finally, you're a junior second year with the Beacon. Senior day upcoming on Thursday. How big is it to finish strong and especially play well on Thursday for your senior? Yeah, it'd be awesome to pick up another one tomorrow and then two more on Thursday or Friday whenever we're playing. Roll into playoffs hot and just keep it going. Thanks so much for your time, guys. The Beacons is 17-5 winner over Saudi Regina.